Okay guys, I am back with another video. This video is going to just be majority of me talking and showing you my computer screen. A lot of people are trying to start businesses and I just want to give you guys some insight on how you can find your own vendors by yourself without paying for them every single time. So stay tuned to see how you can search for your own vendors. We're going to start with this t-shirt brand. So let's say you want to sell t-shirts. I'm just scrolling through. This is a company that I have used personally. So if you want to, you can just rewind and go ahead and write that name down. But yeah, so you can see that they don't only do t-shirts. They have any type of heat pressing, uh, vinyl, like they have everything on here. And I'm just scrolling through and showing you the prices. Okay, so we're going to pick a random t-shirt from this company, and I'm trying to show you guys the video. Just give it one second to load. Let's see here. Alright, now it has loaded. This company is showing you the their behind the scenes, which is very important to me because I want to make sure that this company is legit. And unfortunately, there is no way to know if they got this video from somewhere, but... Um, this company has very great reviews as you can see on the right so I know that this video did come from this company because when I use them they sent me videos as well of my items so I'm just showing you the uh, highlighting the reviews on the right the shipping the time and you can see all of that on every single item that you click on so I'm gonna go ahead and pull out my calculator and show you guys an example of the pricing so let's say that each shirt was five dollars right and then you want to buy a hundred shirts plus shipping let's just say it's a hundred and twenty dollars and then you want to divide that by the hundred hundred shirts that you're going to sell which is six dollars and two twenty cents that is extremely cheap you can sell your shirt for fifteen plus and at this point you're making profit um, you're going to get your money back plus more. And that's just an example of one thing. Now this company, they have lanyards, they have, you know, custom logo, everything basically. It's just a lot of things that you can use. You see they on the, on the left it says keychains, bag hangers, coins, metal, like they have everything on there. So I'm going to go ahead and just scroll through this company so you can see what they have. And yeah. So we're going to click on a random one. This one says custom design, which is what some of you may be looking for. So excuse my slow Wi-Fi. Once you click on it, you're gonna see that there's different examples of ones that they have done before. Again on the right, check out the reviews. 4.9 stars, amazing, we love it. Now let's go ahead and see how we can contact this uh, supplier. I'm going to type up a, uh, an example of a message. It's not professional to, you know, the highest degree, but it is getting the point across and just letting them know. So I'm just telling them that my name is Miss Kalia Tichel, Um and I'm telling them what my boutique is called. And I'm also going to let them know what I want. And I'm going to let them know how many I want. I'm going to also attach my logo and I'm going to tell them how I want my logo on there and what color I want the linear to be. And it's as simple as that. So just, you can see me type out the message. And we're not going to send it, but this is just an example of how you would do it. And on the bottom, you can see where it says add attachment. That is where you will be adding your logo. And on the top, you can see quantity. You can go ahead and change that to 100 or how many ever you want. But the reason I'm assuming I didn't look at the previous um, page why it has 50 because that may be the minimum that you can use for this specific vendor.
now we are going to move on to custom packaging. Now, uh, this custom packaging is not, the video that I tried to click on is not loading, but I wanted you guys to see it. You can always check this company out and check out the video. Unfortunately, my Wi-Fi is acting up terribly tonight. But yeah, so you can see this company has amazing machines. You can see their work that they have done before. You can see almost everything. And you can see that um, how many the minimum is. So for this item, I'm going to click on a random one. Again, you can see the pricing for how many pieces you're going to get. And then again, on the right, you can see 4.9 stars. They've been doing business for 11 years. And to me, that speaks volume. And when I'm looking for a vendor, those are things that I'm looking for. So I'm just clicking through, exiting out, just um, letting go of the old ones. Now I do want to show you guys how to search your own items. Because, you know, your business may not be the one that I have already set before. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how you search your own items. But there is one more uh, technology brand that I want you guys to see first. So as you see, people do sell AirPods, headphones. Uh, they may or may not put the Apple logo on them. But hey, if this is what you're interested in, here's another example of what it is. Uh, you can see that they are only $9.50 per price. People are buying headphones for over $100. You can sell it for how much you want to. Um, you can see that they have 4.6 stars and they've been around for two years. You can see they have a very high response rate, which means you can ask them all the questions you would like. And, you know, you can just take it from there. And assuming that you already have knowledge on how to run a business, or you may not. But this is just a video strictly on how to use vendors to the, or how to find your own vendors. Now we have moved on to Uggs again. This is on you and if you want to use these vendors or not. Uh, the rating is 4.8. Again, that's a great rating and they've been in business for one year. But to have that kind of rating, it does speak volume for the company. Now, gold supplier. I wanted to show you guys what that means. Uh, Alibaba does have the definition of gold supplier on their website. But, you know, it is a premium membership for suppliers on Alibaba. To me, that also just increases whether or not I trust this company or not. You can see that it is $29 for a pair of Uggs, and we know that they retail at over $100 as well. So again, if you do decide to use a business like this or have a business like this, here are options on where you can find things to help you find your own vendor for your business. Now we're just looking through, looking at different types of Uggs. Uh, different companies that sell them, the different styles of Uggs that you can buy for your business. And yeah, again, my Wi-Fi is moving super slow, so it's giving me a really hard time trying to load certain things for you guys. But this is the main picture. You're getting to see everything in the behind the scenes. And unfortunately, when you Google this or Google how to find vendors, Alibaba may not show up. So I want you guys to see from me how to use this website because when I say they literally have everything I'm gonna look up another example makeup lip gloss once you click on it there are tons of, it, of vendors on here you can look at the reviews you can even look at how much money they've made in transactions that these are high numbers these are high high numbers of people who have used these companies or left reviews on these companies which speaks volume to can you trust this company are they credible it's just important to do your research and negotiate. So research and negotiate. And I promise you, you can get almost anything you like from any of these vendors for a price that you're looking for. Now, thank you so much for watching. If you would like to see more videos like this, please let me know. And I got you guys.